Hello, my name is Sledge, and today I'm here to show you how to use Bacchus Mod to set up and play custom Rocket League maps with your friends. Now, most of this tutorial will apply to Steam and Epic users only, but hang in there, console players, as I have a couple things for you guys that you might not have heard of before. The topics we'll cover include installing the Bacchus Mod app and plugins, using Rocket Host to download maps and workshop textures, and how to start a server to play with your friends. We'll also go over the alternate method of using Rocket Plugin and Hamachi to create your own servers, followed by a special section showing how console players can also join up to play some unavailable maps and custom game modes that are built into Rocket League. And then to finish up, I'll be highlighting a community that regularly runs custom map games and can help with any technical difficulties you encounter. All the sections are timestamped, so feel free to skip ahead as needed. The first step is to download Bacchus Mod from the official site, which you can find linked in the description below. Once you have downloaded the Bacchus Mod setup.zip, open the file location and extract. Then run through the setup guide and the app will be installed. If this little Bacchus Mod injector window is open on your desktop, then you know the application is installed and running, and now we can start Rocket League. It doesn't matter if you are Epic or Steam, the mod will work for both. Once in Rocket League, Bacchus Mod is opened using the F2 key on your keyboard. There's a lot of settings and features built into the app, but for this video, we're going to focus on plugins, which you can see I already have a lot of. Now, the easiest and safest way to install Bacchus Mod plugins is from the official site. There you can find over 200 plugins ranging from quality of life improvements to custom mods that change the game or add unique features. Today, we are focusing on how to play custom maps. So we will start with the Rocket Host plugin. By clicking the blue Install with Bacchus Mod button on the plugin page, it will automatically be downloaded and set up to install the next time you run Rocket League. You can close the black command prompt window once it confirms the download is complete. From there, reopen Rocket League, hit F2, go to the Plugins tab, and then open the Plugin Manager. We will need to find the new plugin that was downloaded, and then click the checkbox to enable it. This only needs to be done once, right after you add a new plugin. Now the Rocket Host plugin will appear on the sidebar list, and we can click on it to use or adjust its settings. With the Rocket Host plugin, Creator Jetfox has automated the three crucial steps for playing custom maps in Rocket League. Getting workshop textures, downloading maps, and hosting servers to play with your friends online. This means that even those that don't consider themselves to be computer savvy players should still be able to follow these easy instructions as the plugin automatically places all the files in the correct folders for you. Well, in the plugins tab, click Rocket Host and then open the Rocket Host GUI. To get maps, you click on Steam Workshop Downloader and refresh the data to list all the current custom Rocket League maps with the newest at the top. When you find the map you want, select and click download. If this is your first time playing custom maps, a pop-up will prompt you to download the workshop textures, but this will be a one-time thing. After restarting your game, you're now ready to host a match with your friends on that map. After making sure your friends have followed all the previous directions to download Rocket Host, the textures, and the map you'll be playing, it's now time for the final step, requesting a server. Note, Rocket Host is a US central server, meaning if you're not an A, you may want to instead host the game on your own computer, which will be discussed in the next section. Before launching the server, select the game mode, number of players, and any mutators you want. Then click the Request Server button and wait a moment or two for the server to start. Once you are in-game, your hypothetical friends will now be able to join you from the Rocket Host GUI by refreshing the active server list, selecting the correct map, and clicking Connect. Rocket Host currently supports over 500 workshop maps, but it doesn't have all of them. In the event that the server doesn't have a map, a red box will appear and you will instead be put in a LAN match that has been hosted on your own computer. You will still be able to play with your friends, but you won't be able to connect through Rocket Host. Instead, it will require you to follow the directions for Rocket Plugin, which we will cover Next, for those a little more experienced with custom maps, Rocket Plugin is a perfectly valid alternative. Some disadvantages to this method is that it doesn't download map files for you and will require the use of a VPN for multiplayer. But on the positive side, Rocket Plugin allows you to run custom mods in your multiplayer games as seen in some of the videos I do on this channel. Rocket Plugin servers are hosted on your own computer and your friends will thus have to connect to you. To do this safely and easily, we recommend Hamachi. Hamachi is a free VPN that protects your IP by giving you a fake address to share instead. Setup is fairly simple. First, download the Hamachi app from vpn.net and run the installation. To use Hamachi, you'll have to create a new LogMeIn account, but you do not need to enter your actual personal info while doing this. Note, Hamachi may need to be whitelisted with your firewall for it to allow players to connect to you. If you are the host, you're going to have to create a network. While the app is running on your desktop, click Network, create a new network, and choose a name and password. Then send the info to your friends, who will also use Hamachi to join your existing network. 
If everything is working, you'll be able to see their computers joining in the app, as well as a green light to indicate a good connection. After installing Rocket Plugin from the Bacchus Mod site, the setup is very similar to using Rocket Host. Enable Workshop Maps, select the one you want, adjust player count and mutators, then click Host. This will start a lobby on your computer, and your friends will connect to you via Hamachi. On their end, they will right-click the host name in Hamachi, copy the IPv4, and then paste it in the join box within Rocket Plugin. The port is always four sevens with no password, and you don't need to check the joining custom map box. If the host's firewall settings are correct, the IP box will be green, and they will be able to join. All right, I know by now you console players are tired of being left out, but today I'm happy to say I at least have something to offer you guys. First, there is the out of map training packs. Linked in the description of this video is multiple training packs players have made that put your car outside the playing field and allow you to practice your aerial skills more freely and explore the scenery. A common favorite is the drop shot map in which the structures can be used like a rings run. Now it's not perfect, but it's better than nothing. Next up for console players is custom matches from Rocket Host that anyone can join. Now these are not quite custom maps, but it will allow you to play some wacky game modes and cool in-game maps not accessible to regular console players. The one catch being that you need at least one person on PC for this to work. All the console players will join the PC player's party, and then in Rocket Host, they will select the option to host on Rocket League servers. Notice my son, who is on Nintendo Switch, is currently in my party, and we are now joining a match on Loophole, an unavailable map that was part of an LTM in 2021. In fact, just by adjusting Rocket Host settings, we can even play Heatseeker on this map. Setting up and playing custom maps with your friends in Rocket League doesn't have to be hard or scary. I hope this tutorial has got you started on the right path, but for more assistance, I'd like to introduce Balanced Waffle from the Community Workshop Games Discord. Thanks, Sledge. CWG is the fastest growing Discord community created specifically for custom maps within Rocket League. We have built a massive FAQ section covering any problems you may encounter. Using the search bar, you can find answers to nearly any question. Some include having issues connecting on Hamachi, how to fix the content mismatch error, or what to do if you get password does not match. And if you still need some more help, you can ping the at helper role for assistance. We've helped thousands of members get set up for workshop maps. But CWG is also more than that. We are a place to find like-minded players to play custom maps with. We run open community game nights and some bigger charitable events like Battle Royale, Hide and Seek, and our 104 player world record. If any of these interest you, feel free to join the invite link in the description. All right, well, big thanks to Balanced Waffle and his community for all their work on this project. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, make sure you give it a like, subscribe, and check out some of my other content linked here. My name is Rocket Sledge. Thanks for watching.